In the year 2345, the Federation of Planets opened a Starfleet Academy near Carnoustie in Scotland. Four <laughs> years later, its first graduates emerged to find themselves rewarded with the command of Starfleet's newest and most powerful vessel, the Ion Impulse-powered Aurora. Right, Ensign, he's what Factor 10. We'll open this big bastard up and see if it has shit off a shoulder here. Nadine, you get your belt soon. No captures wearing belt like a bunch of big poofters. Yep. What? Before you let us go with the replicator, I'm starving. All right. As long as you bring us back, I'm going to a Royal Game Soup and a couple of ciders. <laughs> Captain. What now? There are a wreck, big hoory, a spaceship coming to the waltzes. You know why you see the bastard the size of the thing is? I can't get up twice sizes bigger than your skin. These graduates never backed away from conflict, as they were fearless and highly trained. I tell you, four in the middle of your pistol stick, it's not your clacker back. <laughs> What are you doing, you dafty? Well, I'm just saying I go on a holiday, can't them holiday, daft, Ken! <laughs> oh. <laughs> Take a journey into the unknown with Captain McConnell. Set faces to Malky. There's number one, O'Donnell. It's like he hob I've ever seen a four, Captain Ken! <laughs> Dr. McDonald. He's dead, Captain. Still in dead. Nepal for nothing. Will you stop kicking at my arse, you pervert? I'm Sam McKay, the android, and McDade, the communications officer. Captain, we're meddling with forces we can't possibly comprehend. You can find your gagging for the E. You've <laughs> got a chance of getting your hole. You're an android, you've got a knob. <laughs> In 60 seconds, we will board your ship, and you will surrender your vessel to us. Oh, go on, don't talk, Tay-siders in space, in amongst you. 